folks in this episode i'll be teaching you guys how to draw an octagon within a given circle so the first step, the first step is to draw the given circle let's draw a given circle here so this is a given circle and it has you can pick any circle of any radius so but if you are told the um the length of the diameter of the the octagon you are going to use it to construct the, the um, circle so yeah we are not doing any data so we'll just draw a random circle now the next step is to bisect each of the 90 degree angles uh that of the um, diameters so i'll first of all I'll draw diameters as right angles so these are my right angle diameters so i'll draw another one as right angle to it Here we go. So drawing it, this one, extending it downwards. So we have the diameters. Now the next step is to bisect each of the 90 degrees. So how to bisect an angle? So we'll talk about that. You just put your compass at the point, draw an arc, open to a convenient radius, cut at one of the points, and cut at the second point. Now the next stage, we'll still do, we'll do the same thing for the um, other side. Draw an arc, open to a convenient radius, cut, and then go down, cut. So now we'll join those um, intersections through the center of the circle, and that will be the points. We'll draw them to the circumference, so if many circumference, then this one also. Now the last step is to join all the points on the circumference. So let's join this point to this point, this point to this point. This point to this point, this point to this point, and so on and so forth. So I'll join, I'll, I'll join the parallel sides first. So, for good reason, it's to save time, to so avoid to uh, minimize the amount of movement of the ruler. Now I've joined all the um, points on the circumference and this is the um, octagon. You can also number your octagon that if you desire, but it, it, it is very good to number in drawings. So let's call this one, so three. But most of the time you number your, um, the vertices and the edges of your shapes. So this is so that you can easily reference anytime you want to use those shapes to draw further shapes. Thanks for watching.